What is up, y'all? Hope y'all having a great day. We're out here at Highland Park for the back nine and part two of the course vlog. Two under on the front. Want to take a low here on the back, see if we can do a little bit better. Didn't have a bogey on the front, so that was great, but our green reading and our wedge play, not so great. Started off with two birdies and then parred seven straight holes. We're on to number 10, par four, 385 yards down the hill. Probably gonna hit a stinger because there is some hazard up there. Don't want to hit it through the fairway. This hole does bend a little to the right, and as you can see, down there at the end of the fairway, there is the hazard. Great shape right here. Yes, Marshall did outdrive me. He's a little closer down to the water's edge than I am. I have 96 yards left. Wild wedge in hand. Let's knock it close. So I was left with the wedges on the front nine and we're right here on the back nine. There's where mine ended up right there. Pretty much pin high. We're looking at about 30 feet left, probably breaking on camera to the left, but from my putting angle to the right. It's a par here on 10. Snazzy hat you got on there, sir. Yeah, you like that? I do. Ostrich official. Looking fresh, go, uh, sir. Go swipe up or whatever it is you do <laughs> and uh, order a couple. Two under on the day, even par on the back. We're on to number 11. Par three down the hill, 173, with a pretty strong breeze into. I'm going to be hitting a seven iron. Should be a pretty good number right there, just a little left of the flag. Walking up here in great shape, landed right there, hopped up to there, roughly 20 feet left, putting back down the hill. Oh, that was in the jaws if I had hit it. Oh. Par here on 11. Number 12 here, par 5, 541 yards, straight away, but very tight, out of bounds all down the left, but the fairway does slope from right to left. Tia High, let it fly. happy with that tee shot right there. It all kind of slopes down to the left. I hit it up on the right side. It all kicks down kind of here on the left. We have 183 left into the wind, probably playing 195. I'm going to hit a seven iron because you don't want to be too long. Roughly going to play this about 190. Let's give ourselves an eagle look. Definitely left that one out to the right. However, missed it in the right place. Pin high, a lot of green to work with. Gonna land this eh, about midway between the edge of the green and the hole. Let's get it up and down. That is our first pin slammer here on the back. Pin slammer there on 12. That was huge. Gets us to three under on the day and one under here on the back nine in part two. We're on to number 13, 
par three, 115 yards. This pin's tucked on that far right corner. Gonna try to play a little baby fade with the sand wedge. A couple darts thrown, Marsh throwing it in there close, and that is the wedge I was looking for, roughly 10 feet left for Bird. Three under through 13 holes, one under here on the back. We've got some drivable par fours coming up. However, wanted to stop and take a minute and say how impressed I am with the greens out here and the fairways, just the overall condition of this course. For 30 to $60, depending on when you come play this course, that is a bargain. It is a fun course. Lots of holes to hit stingers on. Lots of holes to tee it high, let it fly, and get aggressive because we didn't come here to lay up. We're on to number 14. Number 14 here, par four, 276 yards up the hill. It is drivable. You can see the pin there just over the bunker. to be left side of the green couldn't quite see it down we'll go find it all righty so there it is in the tall cabbage little long left that's what we're faced with coming back might have gotten the distance wrong on this hole not quite sure Well, that came out a bit hot. Thought it would trundle down off of the slope. It's a pretty severe slope right there. It got hung up. This is what we're faced with for our birdie. Probably gonna use putter. to see the bogey on a drivable par four got into a little trouble even par here on the back not what we we're looking for out of the bogey right there on 14 we're on to number 15 par four 326 yards down the hill we're gonna knock this one on i've got a good feeling to high let it fly All right, so this is way offline, way right. However, we're not out of this hole yet. Here's where the hole is. Back down the hill, I'm gonna have roughly 40 yards left. That was a ways right. Let's knock this close. here on 15. We're on to number 16, par four, 350 yards, pretty much straight away going back up the hill. I kind of just want to hit a stinger right here. Stinger time. right but I feel like it should be on a pretty good number just a little long back edge not in too bad a shape right here roughly 25 feet and that's a par here on 16. Marshall that's a pretty awesome view right there that's downtown Beeham downtown Beeham yeah it's pretty good view from up here two under on the day 
even on the back. 17 par three, 94 yards. Pretty straightforward little par three here. Would love to hit a wedge close. It's been a little while. And Marshall throwing a dart right there, just a few feet left for his bird. A little long here for me. Might have juiced that wedge just a bit too much. 30 feet left for birdie. I see the look in his eyes. He's got a birdie pin slamming opportunity right here. Can Marshall do it? Can he do it? Marsh, oh, I was rooting for you. Everyone at home was rooting for you as well. That wasn't like you. Maybe pulled just a little bit. Just a little pull, pressure got to me. Number 18, 351 yards. Would love to finish with a birdie. Getting up here to the green, I am pin high. Marshall, did you expect that? Yeah, that's a long way. I was not expecting that to be up here. That was my best drive of the day. Just a little left, but hit it very well. That's what we wanted to end on. Let's get this up and down for Bird. how we like to end it right there, pin slammer here on the last. Marshall ending it with the double pin slammer, let's go. Double pin slammer, double sir. Double pin slammer, uh, you like to see it. You love to see the double like pin slammer on 18. Very good finish for both of us. Very impressive drive there. Um, <laughs> I was, was not expecting that to be, I mean, you hit it good, but wasn't expecting that to be all the way up here on the green, so. <laughs> I was just off, but pin high. Yeah, I mean, it's up. That is it, finished at three under 67. This is a par 70, one under on the back, two under on the front. Y'all, until next time, see you when we see you. Peace.